Questions, questions et commentaires. The Honourable Member from Cowichan, Malahat Langford. Uh, thank you, Madam Speaker. <clears throat> I'd first like to start off by thanking the Honourable Member for his service. Um, I have many friends who, who serve currently. I lost a former schoolmate of mine in Afghanistan, and I myself am the son of a retired service officer. I think everyone in this House agrees that the men and women of our Canadian Armed Forces do an outstanding job every time they are called into action. Since being elected to this House as a Member of Parliament for the great people of Couch and Malahat Langford, it, it, I've really become aware of the responsibility that rests on my shoulders. The things that we debate in this House have very real outcomes in the course that we are directing this country in. And, you know, when I'm thinking about the motion that we're debating today, there's one expression that I really come to mind. In order for us to extend our hands, we must first unclench our fist. And I've always been struck by the rationale by meeting violence with more violence and expecting that we are somehow going to reach a peaceful outcome. So my question to my honourable colleague is, can he please explain how he believes that bombing will work given the fact that we have so many examples from the region over, over a decade that this does not, in fact, lead to a peaceful outcome? Thank you. The, the Charlebourg 